What's going on guys, thanks for tuning back to another video where today I'm going to show you how you can bypass the Pokemon Go uh, root detector if your, uh, if your device is rooted. I'm going to show you how you can bypass the root without downloading anything, installing anything without using a computer and um, without rerouting it. But obviously you need to unroot and then reroute, but it's a very simple way to do it and very easy. So I have, uh, as you can see, the Asus um, phone right here. And I'm just going to sh uh, prove that I, my phone is really safe. If I go to root, check a basic, verify root, boom, it says congratulations, root access is properly installed on this device. And now I'm just going to quickly show you if I go on Pokemon Go real quick. And then when it boots up, hopefully it boots up. Yeah, so when it boots up, then eventually it will say that the device uh, comma OS is not compatible with the device because um as it's not, it is compatible but it's just saying because it's rooted that you can't play Pokemon Go. So I'm just gonna quickly show that message just to prove it as it loads up. And there we go. So this device OS or software is not compatible with Pokemon Go. And now this is the play, uh, thing that you have to do to make it work. So first of all Go on to ES File Explorer. There'll be a link in the, in the description to download it or simply download it from Google Play Store. Once you've downloaded it, click on the three um, line things, option thing on the top left corner. Click on that and then scroll down where it says Root Explorer. Make sure that's checked on. So make that's checked on where it's like bluish right here. And then once that is done, then go on here where it says Internal Storage. Click on that and it'll bring you here. Go on where it says storage so here as you can see this section here click um, actually this section here right here as you can see moving just drag it to the left or drag it to the right however you see it and where it says that uh, slash mark or forward slash click on that and boom we are in the root section of the device now what you need to do is scroll down and find system find a system folder click on that and then what you need to do is um, once you're on that click on bin right here Where's a bin folder? Click on that. Oh, don't hold it. Just click on it once. Wait, let's go back. Click on it once and then locate SU. So locate SU and some devices, if like you have a, you don't, you have different devices. Some uh, um, uh, devices won't have the file in bin. So if you don't have a uh, file in bin, it's fine. Just leave it. If you do what you need to do, simply uh, hold on it and rename it as well. So it's literally, uh, for example, if this was it says su just hold in it and let's go back and add the bottom it says rename and then just add a one at the end of su right here and once you've done that for that file and su if you have it on there um and that's good then go back and go uh, back again then click on x bin which should be located near the bottom click on that and this is what every it's on this folder every device should have the su file right here as you can see su right file right here so hold on that and then click rename and then change it to one and then click ok um like that and then it says rename successfully and also if you have another su at the end as you can see this is demon su because i need to do demon to root my phone just click on that if you have another most devices wait but i have it so if you guys have it then click on it click rename and then as i said just add a one or two or whatever just add an extra letter. i'm just going to add a one to it and boom it's done so now if we go on to root checker basic and let's actually clear that let's open up again and then click verify uh verify root boom it says sorry we accident properly installed on this device now if we go on to pokemon go as you can see you'll be able to play pokemon go easy and i'm going to show you how you can reverse it back um, to make your device root again so basically uh, do the thing that I showed you to play Pokemon Go and then I'm going to show you another way to if you're not playing Pokemon Go and you're back uh, and you want your phone rooted again so I'm just going to wait for this to load up right here just to prove that it actually works as it boots up loading um, okay there we go see as you can see it's loaded and bam my character's right here there we go Boom, so as you can see it works and yeah, so now once you're finished playing the game then you can just simply clear it, clear it and now go back on ES File Explorer and then go back on the fi file, so if, if in the bin folder there's SU, change that back to uh, just get rid of the one that you added 
Um, so for example, if I go back on X bin, click on that. So whatever you renamed SU, just get rid of the thing. So SU right here, just get rid of the one, click OK. And then Demon SU right here, click rename and get rid of the one right here, click OK, and boom, your device is root again. So if I go back on root checker basic, wait one sec, clear it and root checker basic, and then click on verify root, bam it has your root has simply installed very easy and very simple and some some problems that people actually get is sometimes once you renamed it you can't like rename it back or get rid of the one um if the, if that case happens simply go onto your uh, super su application so right here let's click on that super su uh, and then it will say that oh it needs to be updated or whatever and then click continue and reboot reboot and then it should work um, like so um, and now as you can see if I go and pack, uh, back on Pokemon Go it won't allow me and yeah because my device is back to root so obviously guys if you did enjoy make sure you give it a thumbs up if it did help give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy as I said give it a thumbs up comment down below if any other problems you face or it didn't work for you I will gladly help you in the comment section but if it did as I said subscribe if you're new and give it a like share the video and yeah I'll see you guys in another video peace so uh before we actually end the video i'm just gonna there we go see as you can see this this device is not compatible so yeah that's pretty much it and yeah see you guys